Hello viewers, uh, this is the listener here. Um, just a little update on what's going on, why I haven't really been uh, posting videos for a bit. Um, for one, I've been working on a few videos with um, 120 Star Productions. Great guy, he's funny as anything. And um, we did a little uh, let's play of Stargate, of a uh, Stargate map on Left 4 Dead 2. He's already uploaded his uh, footage of it, but as he said in the video, he had a bit of an issue. But um, my my I already I recorded it too, so once my footage gets up there, you can see the rest of our little adventure we had. It was quite fun. It was a bit dull at first, but it got a lot more interesting later on. Sorry, it's a bit dark, but I think everything now. Turn the microphone charger. Okay, that's a bit better. Looks weird, but okay. But, um... Yeah, uh... Now... Down to the main issue. My main PC is currently dead. As in the hard drive. Isn't dead, but... A virus got it. Pretty much destroyed the C drive, so I'll, I'll have to reformat when I can. Getting a new copy of Windows 7 soon. I just have to, uh... Get a double layer CD to support the size, but um, yeah. Happen when I was happen when I downloaded Grand Chase. Actually, I downloaded it before and it worked fine. And my friends had downloaded it and it worked fine as well. I don't know what went wrong, seriously. And well, I ended up running it, and it installed fine. So when I loaded it up. It brought my computer down to a whopping about 2 FPS, 2 frames per second. Didn't know what the hell was going on. And when it was actually loading up the game, it detected like two, it detected two hacker sla hacked slash third party programs. Kept, kept saying it was going to shut down, but never did. So uh, I had a hard time of trying to alt tab and control delete, try to get to the task manager. Task Manager never popped up, and it was just flipping out. So I just restarted it, and then I picked out I picked out a bit of adware that I thought I removed about a couple weeks ago, but apparently there was still a bit of remnants there. So I deleted that too, and uh, then I kicked it up again to see if it happened again. It happened again. And then, uh, lo and behold, AVG picked up something after it ran, and it. I told it to remove. I told it to remove. I told it to do its job, remove the threat. I never got a chance to actually look at what the threat was exactly, though. So when it removed it, my screen blanked, and came back up. It was to basic theme. My internet was disabled. Pretty much all the secondary drivers were disabled. I don't really know the specifics, but pretty much it was scrambled. And the only thing that was showing up was the AVG. And one of the folders which had Terraria in it. Everything else had closed out. So, I decided to restart my computer. And now I won't even kind of tell I can screen. He's not even on safe mode, so i got to reformat it. Um, let's see. I had footage already rendered for, 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 my, for our first episode of Terraria with Otaku Stock Gaming. Great people, the funny as hell. And, um... Well, they went the rendered footage. Luckily, I still got the raw footage because it's all in a separate partition. I partitioned it into three sections. So, I didn't lose most of my stuff. Everything rendered is gone, though, because it's all in my documents. So, I'll have to start from scratch there, along with the new operating system. And, uh, so for right now, I'm running on a... Well, I'm literally... One of my first computers, I just upgraded a bit. I was going to upgrade a lot more, but it's too old. The model's too old, and it won't support a new video card. And there's only two RAM slots, and I only have... Uh, I either had 256 megabytes or 512 megabyte RAM pieces. And I, just, I just harvested a half a gig from uh, that computer there. Which is the same, pretty much the same model as my dad's back then. So, now it's doing okay. Before it was laggy as crap, but it's doing okay for now. I'm probably going to end up reformatting this as well. Um, 
But don't worry about the raw footage. It's still there. And my uh, J drive. <laughs> so it should be okay. Nothing should have happened to it. All I'm going to do is reformat the C drive. So it shouldn't be too difficult to do. And uh, I should. I, I will get immediately get back to recording. I still need to continue my Cave Story Let's Play. And I'm still going to be doing a Kerbal Space Program. My friend Wasteland Gunner, like I said in the video, referenced me to it. And I was going to get around to it this weekend, but... Then that happened, I'm like, oh no! I got pissed. But I got over it. Because, you know, that's life. The bound happens in or later. And nothing died in there. Like that, like that one right there. That has some problem with the motherboard, whereas I thought it was with the video card. Oh, it's with the motherboard. And that's, that was the computer I had before I had a new one. It was still pretty good. And it died a while back. Uh, all the things stupid. Well, it was a careless mistake I made. I went to a land one night with my bro and a couple of his friends. And uh, I brought that with me because I needed an extra computer for one of his friends. So, I'd apparently put it in sleep mode. I didn't, I don't remember that, and I brought it home, and I didn't plug it in for a good two to three weeks, maybe, and I plugged it back in, it ran fine for a good bit, for like ten minutes, and I was, I was on the desktop, I was screwing around, I forgot what I was doing, I copied the file or whatever, and it just went kaput, didn't know what happened, and then... I tried salvaging the. I tried uh, removing the video card and plugging it into the motherboard where the integrated video card was, and that didn't even work. So, it's something to do with the motherboard. It's no beeps to signify any errors, like no bad, no bad video card or whatever. So I don't know what I'm going to do with that. Um, I should be getting around to reformatting within a couple days now. It shouldn't take too long. Uh. I guess I'd have to say one of the biggest reasons why videos weren't getting uploaded too fast is because I get distracted way too easily. I'm not a persistent person at times, and I am quite a bit of a procrastinator. Not much I can do about that. Well, I can, but I choose not to because I'm lazy. <laughs> I apologize for that, though, and I will get around to doing that. I was also running a fan because I don't know if anyone actually knows about it. And about two months ago, I posted a blog saying I was going to get back to it. I, I was determined. Like, that one night, I had, like, a spurt of writing, writing creativity. And it just died the next day later, and soon after, I just lost all interest. Well, I lose interest in it, but I lost my determination to continue it. I probably will get around to uh, writing or continuing it more. Especially now that I'm running on something like this. And that, that video card from like the one I have, the one I just installed, I copied it from uh, that one right there, the one I salvaged the video, uh, the, mem the RAM from second video card from 2005. NVIDIA GeForce 7600 GS, not bad. It was a mid-end video card for them, so it's like it's all right. It can run, it can run better than what I have before at a ATI Radeon 9500 slash 9700 Pro. It was okay. Emphasis on okay. <laughs> I wouldn't even say that really, but it worked. Proved it. But I just upgraded this computer here. Well, I'm using right now. But um, I appreciate all of you. I I looked at my channel and I saw a bunch. Oh my god, over 800 views on the Legend of Equestria videos. I nearly flipped out, and then when I looked at the views on the Fall of Equestria showcasing. For Terraria, I flipped out even more because I got over 2,000 views. Whereas compared to my Let's Play videos, I got like, what, 16 or 20? And I had no problem with that because I appreciate every single view that I get because I know, at least know that I'm entertaining someone because, I mean, like Wasteland Gunner, he wants to see more Kerbal Space Program from me and he obviously enjoyed my videos. I know, I know. I know a few of y'all actually enjoy my videos too, and I appreciate that. 
so much. And I really hope I continue to entertain you guys more. <laughs> oh, really, thanks, guys. You guys are awesome. Um, I guess one more thing would have to be the uh, Zelda Majora's Mask Let's Play that I'm doing every Wednesday. Um, we had a bit of a... We had a bit of an issue with one of the directors from the channel. Um, I keep forgetting the name of the channel itself. I'll have to link in the description below when I get the chance to upload this. I'm recording this from a Nokia Lumia 870. No, 820, sorry. Um, it's a really nice one, actually. Really nice. Um, so... We had a bit of an issue with uh, technical difficulties and such. Well, not really technical difficulties, just personal difficulties with one of the directors. I don't know how the channel's going, but if it does end up going down, I'm not going to remove my videos. I just have them all unlisted, and pretty much the whole process is I have it unlisted, like I do when they upload to their channel. I can just... I can just ask them to take it down, and then um, pretty much make all of my Zelda videos from unlinked to public, if that happens. I'm hoping that's not, because I do enjoy directing for that channel with a couple of my other friends, including... Uh, 120 Star Productions and James Link Gaming. Uh, a couple others that I don't really know personally. Um, well, Brayden. Brayden's the guy who actually uh, owns it. Owns the channel and mod moderates it. But um, that's about it, I suppose. Uh, we're doing a couple games. Um, specifically, the new update for SCP could David Breach, probably. Um, more Terraria videos. Probably more Killing Floor videos than Left 4 Dead. That's my main goal for now. If there's any suggestions you guys have got for me to play, please don't hesitate to post it in the comments section below. Um, I have fun with really most games. As long as it's well made. I mean, not even really that, because... <laughs> I mean, come on. If a game's fun, it's fun. I don't matter if it's well made or not, really. And graphics don't really matter to me, so if you got any of those indie games that aren't really that well known either, don't hesitate to link in, don't hesitate to comment in them below. Any game really. Any game you want, I'm probably gonna play. <laughs> it depends really, but still, I'm probably gonna play it anyways, just for the heck of it. Um I suppose that's all, honestly. Uh that's uh, that's pretty much brought you all up to date on what's been going on, what happened and why I've not been uploading videos. I have these sort of weird habits where I'll go, I'll, uh, I'll just go into like a small section of a month and just go on an uploading rampage and then I'll just stop for a while, uploading one or two every week or so. Not even that sometimes, and I apologize for that. It's just how I tend to act. And I, I don't know, just... I get distracted usually from fan fiction, which I do enjoy the crap out of, and I'm doing. I do continue. I do plan on continuing um, on uh, more dramatic readings or not dramatic, just comedy readings with a wee wee with we read friendship with Grey Bite. I'm Drift White Mane. Uh, <laughs> so I'm kind of I'm kind of I was kind of still new to the dramatic reading, but it's fun as crap. Um. We do plan on them. Um, oh, I don't know if I don't know if he actually announced this. So I'm not going to spoil what story we're actually doing. But we actually had some interruptions and such technical difficulties and all um, on Graybite's side. Way files uh, got screwed up. So he has to redo his side. I don't know if we're just going to redo it all, or if he's just going to re-record his side. Uh, I realize this video is a bit long. I can't really. Well, I guess I went on tangent sometimes. Story time! But, um, I guess I'll go ahead and, um, end it here at 15 minutes. Uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for sticking with me. I didn't think I'd even get this popular, really. It makes me, honestly, feel kind of honored. <laughs> I just, uh, <laughs> uh, well, I've got almost 150 subscribers. Took me about a year. That's honestly really good in my book. And <laughs> it's, I, I feel like I've done an, I feel like I've done an honor just by entertaining other people because that's what I want to do. It's one, it's one, it's something that I enjoy doing. Let's put it that way. 
I like to see a smile on other people's faces. Genuine smiles. I like that evil ha 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 in your face smile. I mean, that's funny if you're just screaming around them, but you know, I don't want to I'm going off a tangent again. Point is, I like seeing people smile. It makes me feel good inside. So, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.